So I'm going to stop the video here so that I can explain what's going on. Um, I just left the house uh, about 90 miles ago, drove down to Terry's house. Terry's the owner of this Land Cruiser, and we're going to deliver it to her today. And she's going to see it for the first time in several months. And I thought I would just film the whole thing as it happened and see how she reacts, and I thought you'd enjoy that. So let's uh, start the video up and just see what happens. So what do you think? Good. So, you taking pictures of me, are you? Yeah, this is Terry. This is her Land Cruiser and today we're returning it to her. So she hasn't seen it in quite a while. So if you want, we can have a quick look. Let's do it. So I don't know if you saw the new tires yet. I had not. So here's the new tires. See, I shined up the hubcaps for you. Yep. They're all shiny and new. He's such a good guy, Mikey. And you made it. And yep, no problems. Not a problem at all. Look at the inside. Did you see the headliner yet? Have you seen the new headliner? <laughs> Here, let me oh, go around to the other... Nice. Let me go around the other side. Because I got a, something to show you here. So there's a nice new headliner, and if I turn this light on, nice. check that out. Oh, right. Roll bars painted. That's the new um, seat coverings. This is this actually came this way. These are in pretty good shape, yeah, so I just are. left them. This is nice too. And um, nice. see the door seals are new. You can have a. Those are brand new. All the way around. Huh? All the way around. All the window seals. These are all new. And you struggled with those seals. And um, I brought you a bunch of stuff. You can decide what you want to go through here, but the jump seats are back in. Um, these look nice too. Yeah, they work. I actually took some people in a ride with them. Yeah, yeah. did you? Yep. <coughs> the, the door seals are still tight because I just did them, so you got to slam the door a little oh, bit. Okay. Like, you know, and then they'll go shut. They'll get better with time. Let's see, that's new. That works again, the backup light. This works. This works. That's working. Um, really, everything's working. Boy, that sure made a difference in the windows, didn't it? Mm hmm. Yeah, and I cleaned the windows too, but they do look nice and new. The back seals are done too, so the doors don't, the back doors don't rattle anymore. Oh, nice. Not that it's noisy driving in it. But, <laughs> uh, let's see, I put the jerry can holder, so if we find you like a NATO jerry can, we can put that back on there. Like a, at least that was what I, I had in mind, was like a camel jerry can or a red one for gas. It did good on gas. I filled it all the way up and it used, I expected it to use about half of it and it used half of it. So really? that means the engine's running good. Um, really, no problems with the trip. So I'm going to stop the camera now. Okay, cool. Well, I'm back. Uh, Terry brought me back a little while ago. And the garage is empty because the Land Cruiser is now back with its owner in, in Terry's house. It's a little sad having an empty spot in your garage with no, no car project to work on. Um, but I thought now would be a good time to do a little bit of a recap. And 
This project started last October, that would be October of 2019. Uh, Terry and I and her brother John, we brought it up on a trailer because it wasn't running. It had been sitting in Terry's backyard, Terry and Ed's backyard, for about 12 years. Uh, pretty much after Ed, who, who used this for hunting and fishing and things like that, got too old to do such things. Um, Ed died about five years ago, something like that, and uh, every time I'd go down to visit, I, Terry and I would go over and look at that Land Cruiser and go, you know, we need to fix this thing up someday, and well, that finally happened, and uh, you guys got to watch it on YouTube, and uh, it turned out well. I'm happy about that. I'm happy the people like the YouTube channel. Um, anyway, we worked on the I worked on the project on Into the Winter, and in February, I lost my dad. And uh, that's important because my dad was an auto mechanics teacher in high school, and he taught me a lot of the car skills, uh, auto, auto skills that you saw in this video, and I couldn't be more grateful that I got to hang around with him in the shop. and. Got to work on cars, uh, fixed I don't know how many lawnmowers, and uh, anyway, it was a it's a good thing. It's good to know how to work with your hands. Um, then in March, something like that, the pandemic started, and uh, another bad thing happened, which is I got laid off from my job. I was out of work for about six weeks there, and uh, that's bad, but. The upside to it is I had quite a lot of time to work on the Land Cruiser and those six weeks I worked on it most every day and that played a big role in getting it done and out of here and back down to Terry's house where it belongs. And um, the upside to that is I found a, found another job, I started that a few weeks ago and it's working out good so all's well that ends well. Um, as for the future, I'm not sure. We'll see. Um, there won't be any more Land Cruiser working videos, but you never know what's coming next. Um, then the last thing I wanted to say before I close out here is uh, thanks again for watching. Uh, the comments have been uh, really nice. I appreciate them. And uh, I'm glad you watched. It was kind of a pleasant surprise. I didn't expect much of anybody to watch these YouTube videos. It, I was making them mostly for documentary purpose and I was pleasantly surprised that people liked it. And uh, anyway, it was fun. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, we'll see you on down the road.